There's a boat. There's a boat! Ugh. Oh my god, this music. It's interesting that Abby, who's never believed in anything, like all this imagery of a prophet, you know, showing up, is just prominent, like, throughout her story. A little bit more so than, you know, Ellie's, because obviously she was around the Seraphites more. Here's a person who has no faith in anything, and only believes in herself, seeing faith everywhere. Mm, anyways, I digress. You want to pet her? It's okay. Yeah, see? <sighs> well done. You can go see her now if you want. Is she going to be okay? Yeah, actually. They're just kids. I know. Owen gets that. What happened to us? I mean, maybe we stopped looking for the light. Maybe. Maybe. Check on the girl. Still in that hospital. Still stuck in that hospital. Still that little girl trying to save her father. Mm. Typically I don't look for uh, collectibles through here because they've already done this part like three or four times on repeat. But there's light now. Whereas before it was like a red light that was flickering warnings like nonstop. Now there's like an actual light. Shit. <sighs> I'm so ready for this, you guys. I'm so ready. Oh my god, I'm so ready. <sighs> Obviously, Ellie at this time would have found out her location, that she was at the aquarium. And would have been trying to get over here to her. Really to locate Tommy, because Tommy was missing. Bowen? Just me. What are you still doing out there? I was changing her bandages. Can't believe she's on her feet already. 
guys are tough. What are they fighting about? Love doesn't want to leave Seattle. Owen invited them to come to Santa Barbara. That is very Owen. I figured you'd have talked him out of going by now. Actually, I'm going with them. But not if you come. What? They may fall for your little act with these kids, but I don't. There's nothing to fall for. Isaac's top scar killer suddenly had a change of heart. Nothing to do with Owen. Right. I haven't always done the right thing. You're a piece of shit, Abby. You always have been. Mm. I'm done with you. You want to do right by these kids? I'll walk away. Get out of their lives before you screw them over, too. Damn. Here's somebody who literally spent her whole life looking for vengeance. To the point where she just didn't let anybody get close. Because again, it's almost like Joel. Getting close is pain. This morning. Love coming around? He will. Do you mind helping me look for him? He's pretty worked up. Sure. You ran off this way. You guys were back at the aquarium. God, look at her, like. You can see like all the freckles on her shoulder and stuff. Like, look at this fucking detail, you guys. So I don't know. I, obviously, she loves Owen. Um, obviously. Um, but she doesn't want Owen to get close to her, and that's something I've noticed like for a while now. She's kind of just apprehensive about letting anybody get close to her. Looking for collectibles. You guys, I think I'm, uh... I think I'm a little... Like, probably on Chapter 8, if I had to guess. Like, I think I made I it through Chapter 7. Go to Santa Barbara. I'm so worried about our mom. I thought so. About what'll happen to her because of us. Should he be worried? He needs to focus on his own safety right now. Agreed. What could happen to her? Sometimes parents are held responsible for their children's sins. But our mom is so devout, she'll probably be fine. Probably. Are there options for helping her? We can't do anything. No one could. And no one really wants to. Yikes. Lev? Lev, I'm sorry. Lev, come on out! Lev! Did Lev take off? Because I feel Lev. like Lev took off. Lev, please come here! I don't think I've ever been in this part of the aquarium before. Like, shit. Look at this scuba diver. Shipwreck Cove. Really comb in this place while I kind of like getting to look Lev. around and explore a little bit. Lev! You know, I wonder if he saw this. He loves sharks. Loves sharks, but hates the ocean, huh? It really opened up to you. 
We bonded over our shared fear of dying. He said you were brave. He's a liar. I don't know how to thank you. You don't need to. I did it for me. She did. She really did. Everything she did was for her. Like I've been pointing out. She needed to stop feeling so guilty deep down inside. So she did something for someone else. To help her feel better. Despite the fact that she doesn't want to let people in. The ocean's best defense. Healthy reef system. Algae. Blah. You hear that? Lev! Are you in here? Oh, and I got okay. kind of startled off of that. It's okay. She just wants to play. Hey, girl. What you got there? Okay, watch. Go get it, girl. I, uh, I think she wants you to throw it again. Look at it one more time. She's so fast. You want to try? That doesn't seem like a good idea. Try it. She's not going to bite, right? No. Nope. I promise. I have been there. I used to be absolutely petrified of dogs, and I've gotten over it. It's taken a quite a long time. The past 15 years, like, I defeated it so bad. But man, oh man, it took a while, you guys. <laughs> so I can relate. <laughs> Can I do it so again? many levels. I think she would love that. Good girl, Alice. She's just bored. She wants to play. Come on, Alice. We should keep looking for him. I agree. Give the, the give the doggo some scrubbies. Give the doggo some scrubbies. Growling over the toy. She said that's my toy. I love that the game, like, takes a moment to pause and reflect and have, like, these really quiet moments after something really intense. Like that boss encounter. Like, we just had a major boss encounter. Let's pull back. Let's do something really quiet and calm. And, like, that's what the game does. It kind of allows you to have this, like, emotional up and down and emotional up and down. And it just have your adrenaline pumping and then calm you down and adrenaline pumping and then calm you down. Like this, she'd strangle him with her bare hands. How much did he tell you? Not much. I heard some of your people calling him Lily. For a long time. I didn't understand why he was questioning the laws, the traditions. When he explained to me how he felt inside, I told him he had to keep it to himself. I was hoping he'd snap out of it. He seemed fine for a while. Then he shaved his head. Like one of the men. It was suicide. Damn. 
down. Is that when you ran? You had to, probably. First I screamed at him. I hit him. It's a death sentence. I mean, his sister's alive at least, but shit. Well, why do you think he did it now? Shaved his head, I mean. Last week, he got assigned his role in the community. He wanted to be a soldier like me, but they decided he was to be a wife to one of the elders. Yikes. Tradition. Poor kid. Yikes. Hold on, wait, wait, wait. Where is Santa Barbara? It's in California. Where's California? Okay, so look, uh, this is Seattle, and this is Santa Barbara. And our island? It's too small to see, but it would be up here. <laughs> so far. Yeah. Good. Yeah, hopefully you guys actually make it there. At least you two can get out of this mess. Abby pays. <laughs> Abby pays. Justice. It's like, Phil, you're still going on about that. Absolutely. Tentacle staircase. This place is elaborately is designed. Left around here? Mm. We can do better than these shirts. I wonder if that trophy's hidden in here. There's a trophy for finding a strange artifact. I wonder if it's actually going to be here in the gift shop. Just hiding. I'm going to look around. <clears throat> this is cute. Oh, that's kind of cool. I won't lie. See anything worthwhile? No... Keep looking. I'm sure the collectible's in here. Like, I don't know exactly where that last collectible is, but if I had to guess, I'd say it's in here. I'd hide it in here, shit. In a gift shop? It's the best place to hide a collectible like this. Oh, definitely check out this back place first. Is that where I came in at? It was right here. Yeah, it looks like where I came in at. God, this freaking game is like gorgeous. Looks like this is where it is, wherever we're going. Or not, shit. Fucking like little diver suit thing. Well, shit. Oh, can I go through there? No, maybe not. Oh, hey, what's this? Oh, it's a shark. 
So obviously that's where I need to go. Yeah. Wow. Hmm. What about this? It's perfect. Mel's wrong. No. You're a good person. You don't know me. I know enough. Abby, will you stop stealing my stuff, please? I'm sorry, I didn't realize you owned everything in the aquarium. Yeah, well, an aquarium. My stuff. I'm just kidding. Take whatever you want. You can't. Have you seen Lev? Uh, yeah. He was down that hallway. Can I? Can I talk to you? I'll catch up. Okay. She couldn't tell I was joking. I suck with kids. <laughs> really like you though so um you're coming to Santa Barbara right I can't why you know why we can figure this out it's too late no no it isn't Look, I know Yeah. But we can choose to be happy. Happy. We're allowed to be happy. You hear that? Lem! Get back here! Lem! What's he doing? I was worried about this. After who? His mom. She's gonna kill him, Abby. Is the boat ready? Not yet. How much time do you need? Uh, a few hours. Fuck. We'll head him off. We'll grab a boat from the marine. Hey, she just had surgery. I'm fine. How else am I gonna find him? I'll go with you. Owen? They're heading to the fucking island. Exactly. I'm not gonna let her go by herself. Actually, you are. I can help. Yeah, by staying here and fixing the fucking sailboat. Get your priority straight. Yara, let's go. And that is where Abby was on the third day. When all this shit went down. Yikes. There's a the marina. How you doing? I'm good. Okay. Okay. All this to save a life and then ultimately end up uh, screwing up. So we are going to save over the... What is it? Um, I guess we'll save over this one. Screw it. I was like, where is the save file? There it is. So we are actually 27 hours and 16 minutes in. 10 to 13 hours left to go, roughly, uh, somewhere in that range. I'm hearing about, I'm hearing about 13 actually. Um, that is gonna do it for me for right now, you guys. Uh, thank you guys so much for checking out uh, my channel. Um, plays with plays with Gusto. Thank you for the follow, by the way. And uh, Charles Gonzalez Tiger. Uh, thank you for the follow as well. Um, you guys, I'll be back on. Um, Probably in roughly 60 minutes to uh, 90 minutes, I'll be back on. Talk to you later, Pez. Thank you so much for jumping in. I hope you get to feeling better, by the way. And uh, you guys, I'm Phil Nominal, too, here on Twitch. Uh, you can follow me on my YouTube channel, Phil Nominal, and follow me on Twitter, at Phil Nominal, too, to see when I go live. Um, I'll be back in roughly an hour, you guys. I'm going to go grab some grub real quick to make sure I don't have to eat for the rest of the day so I can just play for six, seven hours, and I'll be back for another six, seven hours. We're going to do this, you guys. We're going to beat this game today if I can. Uh, you guys have a great one. Be safe, and uh, I will catch you next time.